Hello everyone. Welcome to a good plate. Pachimirpakaya pachadi is yummy, tangy and spicy. Even kids love to eat it with hot rice and ghee. Let's take a look at the ingredients needed for this. I'm using a mortar and pestle to make the pachimirpakaya pachadi. You can use a blender or a mixer. If you're using a blender or a mixer, add everything except the onion and pulse until you get a semi-coarse texture. After it's ground to a semi-coarse texture, add the onion and pulse once or twice. Do not grind to a smooth paste. Take about 12 serrano chilies. I'm using a combination of unripe and ripening ones. You can use just unripe chilies. Add them to the mortar. One and a half inch of ginger after peeling the outer skin. Salt, one and a half teaspoon, or to taste. Pound everything well to a coarse texture. Once the pachadi is almost coarsely pounded, add 15 grams of tamarind that's been soaked in little water to soften. Pound everything well again to a coarse texture. Once it's pounded to the texture shown, add one small onion cubed. Pound again roughly. Let's do the tempering. Take a wok or kadai, keep it on medium flame. Add two tablespoons of oil. Once the oil is warm enough, add half a teaspoon of mustard seeds, one teaspoon of Bengal gram, one dry red chili. Let the mustard seeds splutter. Once the mustard seeds have splutted, turn off the flame. Add one sprig of curry leaves. One fourth teaspoon of hing. Give it a mix. Add the tempering to the ground or pounded pachimirpakaya pachadi and give it a mix. Yummy pachimirpakaya pachadi is ready. Serve the pachimirpakaya pachadi with hot rice and ghee, or with idli or dosa, or with curd or buttermilk rice. If you like the recipe, please. Like, share and subscribe to the A Good Plate YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. Happy cooking.